It's our first look at a new drone that could be a game changer for the agricultural industry. The T-50 drone is designed to spray crops from up above rather than from the ground. This morning it was on display at Boris Horodnitsky's farm in Innisfil. He's one of many local farmers interested in the new technology. We figured that we'd get better uh, application of our crop protection materials because of the vortex that the drone creates, same as a helicopter or wind, we can get better penetration into the foliage. The drones also eliminate the need to track in the field. Wet conditions can prevent tractors from getting into the fields. The new drone format eliminates those kinds of issues. The drones are controlled by a hand remote. Jenny Chen and her husband Alex act as the general distributors for DJI Agricultural Drones Canada. It has uniform spray to the crops and also make sure the downforce wind that blow the wind down can effectively cover everywhere of the crops, including uh, the back of the leaves, the intersection of the leaves and the roots of the crops. Chen says similar models are already used in many countries around the world. She says the new model can cover as much as 50 acres of land an hour. F no fuel. It's all uh, battery operated. It's going to be as long as we can get the regulations to uh, the uh, Transport Canada to uh, change the regs to, so we can get some uh, faster approvals for using these because it is definitely going to be beneficial for the, for the environment. Now Chet says the units cost about $37,000 and says that's about 10% of what some tractors cost. She also says she believes it's the future of farming not only here in Canada but around the world. Rob Cooper, CTV News, Innisfil.